What's up everyone, welcome back to Face Fitness. I've been noticing a lot of questions and I realized that a lot of you are having the same issue. Um, even though you have different questions, it kind of falls into the same subject. Questions like, um, you know, how often should I go to, the, go to the gym? Or how often should I work out per week? Am I old enough to start lifting weight? Having trouble, you know, getting a gym membership. When should I go to the gym? How often should I work out per day? And yes, while those questions may not be bad questions, the issue is if those questions or those concerns or those obstacles are holding you back from working out in general, that's your issue. And I've seen so many people not work out or not train or not start their fitness journey because they can't find the right schedule or find the right timing or get a gym membership or I'm going to get a gym membership next month or I'm going to start going to the gym. And they think that they need a gym or they need a specific workout or these rules, so to speak, or laws before they start training and start getting themselves in shape. I'm a firm believer in this motto called shoot and then aim instead of aim and then shoot. Now, if you're somebody who's doing like heavy lifting and doing this very specific stuff, obviously you want to make sure you're doing things right. But when you're first starting to work out and you're just starting your fitness journey and you haven't really started and it's not a big part of your life, not even a small part of your life, I suggest you shoot and then aim, which means you start doing something and then you figure out the rest, which means if you miss the gym, you still work out. You do a home workout or you do something. You do three sets of push-ups to failure and then you do a wall sit for like 60 seconds and do burpees until you can't breathe. So what I'm saying is that you don't need a gym to work out. You don't need a, a workout to work out. You don't need um, a plan necessarily to start your fitness journey and to start getting yourself in shape. This is honestly probably one of the, or if not the biggest issue I see when it comes to people wanting to get in shape and wanting to start their journey. If you're trying to take your, your fitness level to the next level, yes, you need to make sure you get into a gym or you need to have you know better equipment or whatever. But if you're just trying to get in shape, you're trying to work out and you know shape a certain part of your body. I'm not sure if you watch Wayne's vlogs, but very rarely do you see me actually lifting weights. I'm not a big person to lifting weights. Nothing wrong with it. You don't need to do that, but if you want, if I wanted to tone my body a certain way or get into a certain size, I would need to do that. So what I'm saying is that for the beginner level, for starting to, you know, transform your body into being fit into being in shape, you don't need to have this massive, perfect plan. You don't need to do it that way every time. It should be you work out no matter what, no matter if you're going to the gym or not, whether you have equipment or not, no matter what, or you have a little bit of time or a lot. If you have five minutes, you still do a workout. If you if you do it in the morning or at night, it doesn't matter. You make sure you get your workout in every day, no matter what it is. If I go on vacation, I'm at a hotel or wherever I'm at and I don't have a gym, I still like to do a workout. I'm not gonna allow my body just to start declining because I don't have the right circumstance or the right equipment or the gym. It's not always gonna be that way. And it's not for a long time, you're gonna have obstacles in different circumstances you're gonna have. Especially if you're younger, you're limited anyways. So. I really encourage you to make sure that when it comes to exercise and working out, you don't limit yourself to a specific style of workout. Unless you're trying to hit a goal and you're doing that, that's okay. But if you're just starting out and you're having trouble hitting your first goals or losing that weight in the beginning or seeing some sort of progress in your muscle growth, don't let yourself you know, fall victim to not skipping the gym or skipping workouts because you know, you missed your workout that day or your friend didn't show up or, you know, you didn't know what to do. You, you always, there's always something to do. There's always something you can do. So, so this goes out to the people out there who are really limited with those resources and the different things that they can do. And maybe you don't have a lot of knowledge of what to do for fitness. My goal for you or my challenge to you is to be committed to at least working out five days a week. No matter what that means, commit yourself to pushing yourself to a hard workout at least five days a week, doesn't matter what time of the day, doesn't matter where, weights or not, push yourself to your limit five days a week. And if you do that, I guarantee you, I promise you, and as long as you're eating right too, um, mostly right, you're gonna start seeing some results.